Like I was, I don't even know. I put my hand to my damn mouth, and like the shit was like on my face, and it was in my head. Bitch, I'm back. back, back, back. Everybody, it's me Robin back at it again with another video. Okay, today's video is gonna be a story time. Bitch, this happened to me while I was on my hiatus with y'all. Uh, last month was August. So my mom's birthday was in August, and we went out to this Mexican restaurant to eat some food, right? Bitch, let me tell you. How about we went to this Mexican restaurant? It was good, you know, the food was nice, but we ordered drinks and you know we was having ourselves a good old time kicking and all this and that and i was sitting there playing with my mom i was like bitch this drink's so big like we gonna walk up out of here finna a little tip still a little knee break bitch like i'm sitting there playing with her and my mom was like this drink is big like i don't know if i'm be able to finish this and I was like, girl, I wanted this drink so bad. The way life been making me feel like I just need a drink or whatever. So we got our foods, eating our food or whatever. And I was just getting full, bitch. Face, uh, stuff in my damn face with this uh, chicken quesadilla, bitch. Just eating. Food so damn good. My mama had, like, I think she had a shrimp quesadilla or something like that. I don't really know. And then my cousin, she had like stick chicken and chicken and steak tacos or something. I don't know what she had, but that shit was looking good. And she had a whole lot of shit. And I was like, bitch, I'ma order me some of that to take home, cause a bitch was hungry. So I ordered me some of that to go. And so the drink that we had was called the Rainbow Margarita or something like that. Which it had like all the different flavors and stuff in it. And that shit was so good. But then, I was sitting there just sucking up all this drink. And I was like, bitch, I'm starting to feel good. I feel so good sitting here. And we just sitting here talking, talking. And so, I'm almost at the bottom of my drink. No, I think I had to finish my drink. And I was like, ooh, girl, I'm feeling real good. And then my mom gonna say, I can't even finish mine. So, she asked the waiter. Could she take, like, could she, like, put her drink in a cup or something, like, so she can be able to leave? And so the man was like, no, nah, you ain't going to be able to do that. You ain't going to be able to take your drink up out of here. We can't give you, um, we can't give you this drink and then you take it home or whatever. You can't do that. So, so she was like, oh, girl, I don't want to waste my money. And so she was like, taste this. But y'all don't even know why she told me to taste it. Cause I hadn't, I, like I said, I was like, oh girl, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling real good. I done ate my food. I'm feeling good. Bitch, let me tell you. How, how about, by the time I done sipped that damn drink, my mama drink was way stronger than my drink. I don't know how, but it's like she had more tequila or whatever they fucking made that shit out of. She had more of that in her. So I was trying to help her finish her drink. So she wouldn't waste her money. Because that damn drink was expensive. I think that drink was like $9, $10. And our food was like $9 or $10. And our drink was like more than damn. It was more than our damn food. So I was like, bitch, let me drink your drink. So you won't be to waste your money. I don't even know why I did that, bitch. Well, I drunk her damn drink. I'm sitting over there like, bitch, I ain't feeling. I was just feeling lovely. Like, like bitch, feeling relaxed, chilling. But now I'm feeling like I'm sick. So, with this whole bathroom fiasco situation, I normally don't go to the male's bathroom. Because if I'm looking like this, I'm not finna go to no male's bathroom. Like, bitch, I feel like they gonna be looking at me like, what the fuck you doing in here? You in the wrong bathroom. And that's another story for another time. But I was sitting there thinking like, I really don't want to get up and go to the bathroom. Because they already got this situation going on where they don't want males going to the female bathroom and all this and that. But I really feel like I got to throw the fuck up. Like, I was feeling sick. And I'm like, bitch, I need to get up and go to the bathroom so I can throw up. So, I didn't want to go to the bathroom by myself. So, I was like, mom, you don't want to go, you'll go to the bathroom with me? And she was like, yeah. So, I was like, okay. By the time I stood up, I was like, 
Oh, shit. <laughs> Bitch. I feel like I'm about to damn throw up. So, I'm like walking. But, you know, when you about to throw up, you can't really just move too fast. Because, see, like, the shit going to come up even faster. So, I was like tiptoeing. Bitch trying to be cute. And me and my mom walking. We was damn near by the bathroom. And I just said, look. Threw the fuck up. Like, bitch, I was so embarrassed. Like, I was, I don't even know why I put my hand to my damn mouth. And, like, the shit was, like, on my face. And it was in my hair. Like, I had my weave in. It was in my hair. It was on my damn maroon sixes. Like, bitch, I was like, oh, my God. Like, why? Why? And I don't really think that nobody just, like, looked at me. Because I was, like, back there in the bathroom area or whatever. But still, like, I was so embarrassed. And my mom was like, you okay? So I was starting to have, like, an anxiety attack right there after I did that. Because I was, like, so anxious. I was like, okay, I just want to go home. I was like, oh, my God. Like, I cannot believe it. I just threw up all over the place. And then, so the man was like, uh, oh, my God, what happened? And I was like, looking. I was at the water fountain cleaning my damn face up. And my mom was like, bitch, come on in this bathroom so you can see yourself so you can actually clean your face and like it was a man coming out the damn bath and he was looking like what the fuck but yeah oh my god that was just something that was just so embarrassing and i had to tell you guys because bitch i know he ain't just like no extravagant story but bitch that was something that was like so embarrassing to me i had never thrown up in public and embarrassed myself like that that was just like i don't think i'm ever do that again and I think that I only threw up because I had ate that day. And I was, that was my first time eating. So I was like eating food and drinking that alcohol on an empty stomach. And I never do that shit again. So that was a little story time that I wanted to tell you guys. So if you want me to do more story times or maybe I need to get better with doing story times. Because I haven't been watching story times where folks just be dragging the shit out. I don't want to see videos like that. Bitch, tell me the story and come on. Like, just come on. So with that, <laughs> with that being said, y'all, I'll talk to y'all later.